Richard, tell me about your rugby journey, where it all started for you and where it began right here at Fold. I uh, started uh, many too long ago really in Castleford, West Yorkshire, uh, watching Castleford Rugby Union on a, on a Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon, sorry, and then my dad taking me to watch Castleford Rugby League on a, on a Sunday and it just went through there, League and Union, all the way through until, well, I came here in about six, seven years ago and it's just been a case of club after club, so I've moved around with work and finally settled. Tell me a little bit about what you do on a weekly basis here. What, what does a normal week look like for you? It's it, normally, it's, it's a Tuesday morning when we, uh, there's another, me and another guy do uh, a bit of the backroom stuff. Yep. So wherever we're doing what he's working, I'm working, we'll make sure we've got the stuff ready for the guys. Yep. Often Tuesdays we train away from here. So that's ready. Then it's that, we clean that gear up. Then it's Thursdays. Yep. As everybody in the backroom knows, <laughs> Thursdays and finally the Saturdays. Home games, it's a different kettle of fish to away games because we're worried about ball boys, stuff being ready for visiting sides. It, it's just one long, nice routine, nothing difficult, nothing complicated, but if you get your jobs done right, these lads know it's easy. If there's something missing, you know about it. I bet you do. Yeah. Million dollar question, why do you do it? I don't, I, it well, it's either this or Doc Cotton, isn't it? <laughs> On a Thursday <laughs> evening. So what is it? And, 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 and I don't think the wife would want me in the way of EastEnders. It's all I've ever done. Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays. So it's not, and I love it. I have to ask, um, throughout the season, throughout our journey, a file keeps popping up. The Woodlands is the toughest ground to play in the league. In your opinion, why is this such a feared ground? I, it's, it's not difficult. It's the only place where they're made to play for 80 minutes. Yeah. Everywhere else, you just said they spend time. It's, it, it's all about set piece, set piece, set piece. We do whatever they don't want us to do. And what they don't want us to do is to keep that ball running. And that's why, because at the end of it, everyone's blowing out the backsides. And that's down to what these guys do, which is to keep the ball in play. On the flip side of that, as a member, what makes this club so special? It's still community based. It's, you, you can be sat in, in the office, sat next to the chairman of World Rugby and probably the lead, world's leading attack coach in Brian Ashton. And, and my first session here, I was coaching Jason Robinson and the rest of them. That, that, so you've got that level of, of real legends. And then we've 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 got kids here. We've got the lot. It, it's it's a full prop. It's a full community rugby club. It just runs a whole gamut. It's a great place. What does grassroots rugby mean to you? It's everything. It's it's what it's about. There's there's nothing better than finding a pitch somewhere when you're away and there's just a game on. And all these lads, everybody here, will go watch a game. Doesn't matter who's playing, does it? It's just rugby, and it's great to watch. Richard, absolute pleasure. Thank pleasure you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Cheers, buddy.